When Rhea was first born, I thought something was a little off. And then at a year, I gave her a scrambled egg and her lips swelled and I immediately gave her Benadryl and, um, and she was okay after that, but I was like, okay, let's go to the allergist, let's see what's going on. And she came back positive for almost every food. It was a nut-free camp, so I was only worried about the eggs and... Find me some eggs recipes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> at my old school, I used to sit at like the no nut table and no one would want to sit with me because all their friends had like peanut butter and jelly. So I was sitting alone for like a while. Food allergy moms unfortunately get a bad rap because they're usually a little extra. I didn't realize how true that is. I wouldn't put my worst enemy through this. If I find out that I'm not that allergic to peanuts, I'd love to go to Chick-fil-A. I've just heard about the new allergenist test. I would love to hear that she's not really that allergic to peanuts and that she's gonna be okay. Your test just got back and it says indicates that you're likely not allergic to peanuts. Rhea, what do you think? I'm not allergic to peanuts. <laughs> I'm in, I, I'm actually really in, in shock, but I'm so happy. You know, peanuts is one part of the puzzle for us. It's not everything, but it's huge. It's huge. Oh yeah, now I, I can have like the uh, nut, can like most of the nut candies. Now we don't have to worry so much about taking like everything away that may contain yeah. peanuts. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I think I'm gonna try peanut butter and jelly sandwich. You are? Yeah. Okay. And at least if your sister wants peanut butter and jelly sandwich, you could oh, yeah. and, be and around I, her. And I could have Nutella. Uh, no, a different yeah. nut. Different nut. Congratulations once again. This is quite good news for your daughter and your family. Yay! <laughs> yeah, I would say. <laughs>